For, for this special holiday, we have a dish that will make your friends green with envy. Joining us today is Mary Lyman on behalf of the Cedar Falls Women's Club. Tonight they will be hosting their annual Mulligan Stew Dinner. Thank you for joining us, Mary. Thank you for having me. Um, so, uh, why does the Women's Club host the event every year? This is one of the major events that we host, and our purpose is to raise money, like most events are, and we provide scholarships for music students to go to camp in the summer, and also provide uh, funding for various organizations in the community. Okay, and uh, what other events do you guys host then? We have a Belgian waffle breakfast in May. We have a luncheon in April, a chili supper in November. We have a stand in the summertime at Sturgis Falls Days for lemon shakeups. We offer bingo to the community, and we're part of the Christmas celebration in downtown Cedar Falls. Okay, um, and how many years have you guys been doing the uh, mulligan stew? We've been doing this about 10 years. It's one of the opportunities for members to come together not only to have a good time, but to do a great project. Okay, and um, so here today we have um, a setup as to what it will look like tonight. Yeah, that's right. And uh, so besides the stew, what else will you guys be having? Okay, we have what are called Irish Fever Biscuits. We have Luck of the Irish Jello, and we also have a Blarney Stone um, cupcake that goes with that. And then beverages will be water, coffee, or milk. And you can also have a green beer if you'd like to purchase one, or wine. And um, can people show up to the event um, uh, without having a ticket or anything? Oh, or absolutely. Uh, just come to the clubhouse. We're located at 304 Clay Street, across from Overman Park in Cedar Falls. We uh, start at 5 o'clock, and you can come right to the door, pick up a ticket there. Okay, and um, what makes people want to come back every year? Oh, it tastes really good. It's fun. We're decorated to the hilt for St. Patty's Day, so that makes it fun. And the people who participate just like, like to have a good time, listen to Irish music, and enjoy some good food together. Okay, and um, how do you guys uh, make this stew? Like, what's the process behind that? Oh, we have a whole crew of workers who do that. We have choppers and we have bakers. We have people who do meat and so on and so forth. So they're generally about, oh, maybe eight to 10 people working on this project starting early on yesterday and today. And they all get together in the kitchen and the dining room, start prepping. Uh, in fact, this was prepared yesterday. It's on deck for tonight. Awesome. And um, so with the biscuits and everything else, how much of that stuff do you guys have to make then for tonight? We, uh, let's see. The cup or cupcakes or cake are made in-house. The jello is made in-house. And by the way, that will be in the shape of a shamrock. But I okay. didn't get that done. This is made in-house. And then we, we purchase the biscuits. OK, well, awesome. Well, thank you so much, Mary, for joining us again. Oh, yes. Um, so the event is tonight. will be hosted tonight um, from 5 to 7, correct? It is 5 to 7. And the cost is $9. And that's for adults and children. Uh, under 12 or $4.